Pharmaceuticals have been made for probably 40 plus years using batch technology. You would have discrete amounts of material that are produced one unit operation or step at a time in a batch. And it moves from one stage to the next stage to the next stage. Very simply, continuous manufacturing is a newer way to do pharmaceutical processing where material is continuously fed uh, into a piece of equipment, transformed, and then becomes the final product output in a continuous fashion. The decision to switch to continuous um, really was made through our partnership between development and manufacturing. So we started looking at what that opportunity would mean within the execution of that, you've got cooperation between automation and process engineering quality as uh, you go about doing things differently than you did them before. In manufacturing, we like to talk about safety, so the safety benefit is certainly uh, significant not to be overlooked. We're able to manage things like ergonomic risks better, so you're not having to move around large bins or pieces of equipment as much. It's all contained within one process. And then, of course, there's the speed. We can make batches within minutes to hours rather than days to weeks to uh, turn around a given batch. And so there's a productivity and, and cycle time efficiency that comes with that. From a quality perspective, there's not that much difference. So our products have to comply with what we said it will be, right, for the intended use, either using batch process and continuous. The beauty to continuous manufacturing is that you have it integrated into one system, so you're able to see all that data analytics together, and it helps with the real-time processing monitoring, and we're able to see once again, how is it performing? You know, Is it meeting that effectiveness that we need? Is it trending away from that specification? So it just helps us deliver high product quality, but in a faster manner. We have demonstrated and we have experiences with a reduced uh, footprint in our, our facilities. So that means that several unit operations are happening in the same uh, room. We have also observed real benefits in terms of scale up. That means that we can process a small batch size or a large batch size using the same equipment. It brings flexibility from the demand perspective, which can be translated to the patient needs. I think you're seeing the regulators not only um, express interest, but actually step forward to partner with industry in terms of making sure we're aligned on the expectations, as well as how to bring this technology to the forefront. And it's really been part, from their standpoint, I think, of modernizing the pharmaceutical uh, platforms, and so that's been a key uh, strategy for them. We're going to continue to move towards continuous processes. I think as other companies see the benefits that you gain in terms of speed of process development, uh, safer and greener chemistry, we'll see other companies continue to move that way.